As everyone knows how on earth the coronavirus, COVID-19, has caused an outcry. Meanwhile, a news is spreading like air on social media. The news is, this earth will be destroyed on the upcoming date, April 29th, 2020. Will it really happen? Watch the full video to know in detail. There were several headlines that the world is going to end on 29th, April 2020. It was the fear of asteroid 1998 QR2. So, what is asteroid 1998 QR2? The asteroid is called 52768, 1998 OR2, and it was first spotted in 1998. It will pass within 3,908,791 miles of Earth, moving at 19,461 miles per hour. On April 29th, an asteroid estimated to be between 1.1 and 2.5 miles wide will fly by Earth. If it did, the asteroid is large enough to cause global effects, according to NASA. The flyby is expected to occur on Wednesday, April 29th at 4.56 a.m. Eastern Time, according to NASA's Center for Near-Earth Object Studies. The asteroid was classified as a potentially hazardous object because it passes near Earth's orbit. It's the largest asteroid expected to zip by Earth within this month, but it's not the largest ever. That honor belongs to the asteroid 3122 Florence, 1981 ET3, which flew by and luckily missed colliding with Earth on September 1st, 2017. It will make another pass again on September 2nd, 2057. That asteroid is estimated to be between two and a half and five and a half miles wide. In addition to tracking near-Earth objects that could pose a threat, NASA and other agencies currently have missions underway to study near-Earth asteroids and potentially mitigate the danger of a collision. For your kind information, this huge asteroid is set to safely pass Earth on April 29, 2020. And though the asteroid will not hit the Earth, excitement is building among both professional and amateur astronomers to catch a glimpse of this asteroid. According to experts, the asteroid is at least a mile wide, 1.8 kilometers, and maybe two and a half times that big, 4.1 kilometers. The Virtual Telescope Project in Rome will host a free online public viewing of the asteroid on April 28, 2020. But it is feared that the coronavirus outbreak in Italy and other parts of the world may cast a shadow on this plan. Asteroid 52768 1998 OR2 will pass at some 4 million miles, 6 million kilometers, or about 16 times the Earth-Moon distance but it is still classified as a potentially hazardous asteroid. Don't worry, it won't even come close to hitting us. While an asteroid that size could wreak havoc if it crashed into Earth, prompting some alarmist and misinformed media reports, this asteroid poses no threat. At its closest approach, which will happen at about 5.56 a.m. EDT 0956 GMT, asteroid 1998 OR2 will be 3.9 million miles, 6.3 million kilometers from Earth. That's more than 16 times the average distance between Earth and the Moon. NASA has classified asteroid 1998 OR2 as potentially hazardous, not because it puts Earth in danger, but because it fulfills certain criteria in the agency's classification scheme. According to NASA, an asteroid qualifies as potentially hazardous if its orbit ever intersects Earth's orbit at a distance less than 4.6 million miles, 7.5 million kilometers, or 0.05 astronomical units, the average distance between Earth and the Sun. Asteroid 1998 OR2, which orbits the Sun in between the orbits of Earth and Mars, won't fly by Earth again until May 18, 2031, and it will be farther away, passing about 12 million miles, 19 million kilometers, from our planet, according to NASA. Its next two flybys in 2048 and 2062 will be even farther away, the closest flyby of asteroid 1998 OR2 for the foreseeable future will be on April 16, 2079, when it will be only 1.1 million miles, 1.8 million kilometers away. NASA and its international partners are actively scanning the skies for potentially hazardous asteroids and studying ways to deflect an Earthbound asteroid before it strikes. So far, about one-third of the 25,000 large asteroids thought to be zooming around in Earth's cosmic neighborhood have been discovered.